actually go arcane to get to like that eighth lens. So you're probably shooting for eventually ending up with like eighth lens. Yeah. How how uh when once you start losing a lane, a lot of people are now doing the pull where NTS also like, played it aggressively. Mid. Oh, fairy fire. <laughs> is that gonna oh, be enough? It is. Nine gets the first blood. Massive win. That's what he you're looking needs for. to be ahead in this game. That is what you're looking for here if you're a Tundra with his last big Rubik. And Dendi and NTS. Daskin not listening to me again. No, it's it's fine. I didn't break anything. <laughs> Skeeter? Is he dead? Doppelganger is going to be able to dodge the Ziggy Bomb, but that just means he is in perfect position to get blast off. The nice bait. As long as I... Oh, look at him. He uses waveform. He's like, oh, no, I don't have my mobility ability anymore. Don't Whatever go on me. Whatever am I going to do? Oh, they spotted nine. A perfect target to jump on, but do they have the damage? Blast off's going to go off. Yeah, Sticky bombs. Mine's being laid in everywhere, and nine can't stop it. What a fine. That's a North American speaking right there. Yeah, it really is. That's probably... <laughs> a European would be like, <laughs> ah, more than 20 ping is just too much for me, man. Uh, I mean, if it's raining out and it's 35 <laughs> ping, I, I don't think I can queue up today. <laughs> yeah, well, here in the Americas, in the rugged west, <laughs> I haven't seen lower than 150 my entire life. Nightfall turning into the Bat Rider, trying to keep up with Snaking. Yeah, cliff walking. Walk for walk, Sticky Napalm slowing him down, but it's also slowing down Nightfall. Meanwhile, Blast off, Rod of Atos, hook shot, a lot of abilities to kill 33. There's that clock snap fire connection that has worked really well for Bet Boom. Oh, they got the Sticky Bomb on Sneaking, so they're punish on punish. plus one. It's just a nice little opening that Bet Boom found on 33 getting greedy with the stack, and there's an ancient stack here too. Ooh. They're just gonna clean it up. Gate connection. Anning out here over the long term for Pure, though, do they have the HP to survive yeah, the they... Rubik nukes and stolen level 4 Firestorm? They're willing to fight this too because they've aggroed him scepter on Skeeter. Oh, yeah, he's ready to go. Yeah, he's showing up to this, this should fight. be a great fight for Tundra. Yeah, look at that Firestorm goal. Turn around back on Pure. Skeeter's going to hop down the cliff here to chase after GPK and goes for a TPM. Those stuns. Fine. As the Midas Devour and Phantom Lancer Ags go to work. This is also a game where, you know, I was talking about the scale from the Thunder Supports last time. I was about to say the Ench can help do a bit more this time around than the Pugna in terms of damage output, but Toronto Tokyo is going to put him in the dirt. Another solo pickoff for the clock. Really good pickup because uh, that is him going from level 7 to level 8. Yeah, he's definitely happy about that one. You got double damage on 9, but Rubik does not use this the best. Four staff is up for him, however, which will help with the cog stuns and the pits, which is pretty much all Bet Boom have. So nine should be a lot more survivable in these fights as he pushes towards the Ags. And he did get the morph steal. Well, they see nine coming. Say he wants to go for a kill off of this uh, ward on the high ground, and he is gonna pick Snaking to go on. Let's see if he gets out though. Nightfall. Gonna show some reinforcements. Nice four staff away there from nine. They do manage to get the doom yeah, through the Lincoln. So. Morph is probably just going to start backing out here. Boy, that Firestorm is dangerous, man. Can't even tell which is which here. Oh, it is doing some hefty damage. Pure once again is going to fall to that, and Toronto Tokyo is probably going to get zapped down too. Try to go for the hook shot to get away, but Nine picks up the triple off of that. I can't believe they went for that kill. A lot of weight on him to, to find the connection, and Roche is already dying here. It's dying fast, but I think Bed Boom can get there in time. This TP is so long, but finally they smoke up and start making their way to the pit. Scan is going to be successful, so Tundra will have the heads up to get out of the pit if they want. They're just going to commit, I think. They're just going to commit against this. is dangerous, especially with damage. so much vision available. They have the Rocket Flare that's going to be dangerous with the Kisses now raining in. They're going to commit. Oh, there goes weird. the hook shot. Toronto Tokyo puts them away. The Agent's on the deck, and he picks it up. Toronto, Toronto Tokyo. Tokyo gets it away from the carry. Skeeter dies, and now Bet Boom can just run down Tundra heroes. Pure got doomed, but it just didn't matter. I don't even know if that's the guy you want to doom here. Tundra, get nothing out of that. And the gate to block his path, you can't oh, go can't through. through. <laughs> I didn't know it worked that way. Man, what a monster. Toronto Tokyo Tundra versus Bet Boom underway. Finally. Need to pay for this one, but Bet Boom are actually going to go through the portal, run straight to the Phantom Lancer. Uh oh. Tundra come back into the game in a world of hurt. Skeeter had an hour to think about that one. He did, but apparently Bet Boom fought about it harder because they're not only going to be able to kill Skeeter, they're going to get 33 as well. Wow, that is a huge game changer. Yeah, I mean, I wish I kind of knew what changed, but... Very 
I guess we'll just have to live with that as they find you. <laughs> you mean you don't remember the game before? Absolutely none of it. It's I really got lost in the lore, I'm gonna be honest. I'm still thinking about it, but the Doom dies, the PL dies, your Midas... Oh, GB is just going out there and getting more kills. All right, Tundra absolutely collapsed post pause. I mean, it pretty much guarantees happened to one of these teams. It's going to help you in this late game situation. Snaking goes for the blink, but misses it. That's a tanky Rubik, you got to remember. Yeah, meanwhile, jumping onto the Rubik here. Telekinesis throws himself, doesn't get up the hill, though. Spotted for Snap, trying to get him up, but he cannot get away from all of this bet boom pressure. They are just bringing all of their heroes to these fights, and they are playing fast. Yeah, they're hitting with force and with numbers here. It doesn't look like there's any poke or catch from Tundra to punish. They don't move here. In fact, they're going to turn it back around on Skeeter. Like your help. shot, but nice four staffs getting him away. Toronto Tokyo has to back out. The infinite shot's doing a lot, but the Glimmer Cape will protect him. More damage being thrown around. Firestorms, GPK going for the Rubik. But again, these four staffs, Tundra doing a great job protecting each other until they run out. AY and Snaking, cool. no more saves Damn. available. They ran through those cooldowns. Save, That's level nice 20 shot. Snapfire now. Great blast off. That's going to land Cookie to follow it up. Dead Phantom Lancer with a buyback on Snaking when your carry is already gone. This is going to feel very bad for him. Nightfall Stain, he wants to fight. But they're going to go without GPK. I mean, he does have bots. He can come back into play. They're going to break the Enchantress. This go is for the pickoff. Jump forward with the waveform. Trying Tundra. to get the kill. Tundra on the run. Some of them going to the Roshan pit. 33 just trying to get out alive. Yeah, they caught him half and half. Near. Oh, blink away. Got out with the purge on himself. Cool move. But Nightfall still going to be able to catch up to him has the extra movement speed and will cut him down. Meanwhile though, Tundra, they're not doing Roshan and Bet Boom know it. Yeah, they, there's no way they can commit. It's not fast enough. That was a smart play by, by Nightfall, right? He knows that Tundra are gonna go to this dire side, so he's basically predicting they're gonna split up and he wants to take advantage of the stragglers. Catches the Enchantress, catches the Doom. Very heads up play. Now they have a numbers advantage. No 33 Doom, no buyback in sight. A little bit off the mark. Look at this Nightfall getting right on top of nine. Goes for snaking instead. Fast execution. So fast. Now a four versus five becomes a three versus five. Before the Phantom Lancer gets to six slot territory, which might not even guarantee win Tundra the game, but will definitely make it more difficult. Run at you Save. all the time. He knows Skier's here. Missed out on the blast off, but they How can break the know? link. Let's get the scythe. Great use by save in the mine. Almost the double the is toss away once again. Nine, the saving grace. But the hook shot from behind. Toronto Tokyo will push him back. They've got a real opportunity. Skeeter's going to jump up to the high ground. They do have vision, but GPK cannot get in range. Now it's going to be 33, going to be the target instead. GPK mows him down with the shredder. Nightfall says, get out of my way, Tormentor. He's still looking with this hex. Blind goes for it. Only illusions. GPK will turn around and go for AEY instead. Instant Scythe once again. Save is on point with this item usage right now. Uh, he's just cruising through them, creating the openings for the team, and the damage is there to clean it up, even the courier. In a pit. Well, at least the spider has a friend now. It's going to turn into gold. Okay, well, here's your high ground siege into the mine. <laughs> Have fun. Oh, he forced him in! Before Telkinesis, is no way! Mine they got him off, they got him! What oh, nine. a from Tundra! You god. You absolute high ground. Oh, look at hey, hey. He's gonna lay out his own mines, try and kill his own carry, but Skeeter does manage to stay alive. Save will die for that attempt. Two down, and now a chase. Tundra trying to get more heroes. Telekinesis will stop the TP away from Toronto, Tokyo, and they get a gem back. They get both gems, as that other gem is still there, I'm sure. You combine that with the mines, and they have a pretty good idea where Bed Boom isn't. Oh, the lasso almost caught up a GPK. Now they're able to get the counter initiation on a Snake King. Texas are way too hard for the Batrider to go into. Trying to jetpack away AUI, hoping to finish him off. Glimmer Cape survives as a result. Does the spell steal? That's Kisses. Oh, Kisses stolen. That's a big pickup. That is a huge pickup here. Especially Snake King. Oh, bought back TP'd in, but he didn't want to TP complete the TPs. Do you have a hex on AUI? Toronto Tokyo immediately on the jump on Snake King because that's a dieback hero. Sinking, hit by the cookie, and is gonna die. AOE oh, the egg, but he's the hex. Nice. It stopped the Doom from being able to jump in, and a heavy amount of damage. Waveform actually jumping into that one so he can finish off the Doom himself. Nightfall didn't give a damn about that Doom as long as he has the damage to bring him down. Save gonna miss out on that blast off, but it's clear that Bet Boom can just run down any heroes. At this point, nine, 
just going to have to back away with whatever spells he's stolen. I mean, he did get proximity mines again. So sometimes doing some crazy thing that nobody expects, that makes no sense, is your best option. Well, Crush. maybe you just catch them when they come outside their base, like these two supports. Four staff, Eon Dis for snaking, trying to get over the line. AUI is going to be a lot behind, though. It's already a problem. Yeah. No, you're right. You got to send some illusions in or get somebody. To oh, he tried to four staff here in. Oh, they're gonna cliff the wave. Try and help the wave go in. Okay. Nightfall starts pushing at it. Telekinesis throwing back in once he again. They flashback. Hook shot. Oh, Toronto Tokyo, that's not where you want to be. He's gonna die almost instantly in the out. Yeah, doom. doom on top of all these low health heroes. Three heroes are already gone. They're gonna start buying back on some of them. Toronto Tokyo, but I think the rest realize this is a bad fight. This there is, is no really saving it. Fight. There's maybe no saving Nightfall. GPK? He's gonna need the help. GPK? Though. He's got a double shredder. GPK double shredder goes to work. He absolutely shredded the Doom, and now he's looking for more. Tundra retreating back to their high ground, playing the distance game playing off these stolen spells stolen nine though gonna be caught by that shredder force that force staff gets him away gpk couldn't finish off Yo, the these illusions laner. these illusions save him so much damage GPK. oh my oh jeez. yo this phantom lancer is becoming an issue man octarine 4300 hp these illusions he doesn't even need to be in the fight and he is killing cores this is how tundra win the game like you push a base without buys and they somehow win these base defense fights which have been going super well for them but they don't have to be the ones initiating their lineup. Thrives. Snakey finds the opening. Oh, we got him on the lasso before into the, the mine. Go off into, into the, the mine. He goes. Justice against the techies. Now they got the scythe onto the morphling too as they try to follow save in. He's dead for two minutes, and it's time for Bet Boom to quit this idea Skeeter that they can go to the high go. ground anymore. It is a failed endeavor, my friends. Get out. Save me, says <laughs> Toronto <laughs> Tokyo. But Nightfall says, hey, for your own sins, I'm out of here. I just don't know how you commit on the Tundra high ground. Like, that's the problem. The PL is way too obnoxious. Snaking is right in here. Yeah, Snaking no on here. It was to Tokyo. He's going to use that axe refresh. Hook shot inside the vice. A lot of stuns. But 33 is going to get on top of save. We'll follow up there. But 33 is also taking a lot of damage. He's got to be careful of GPK Shredder. Snaking sacrifices his life to get out some spells and force the buyback. They are poking at them from a distance. Duncan. Kiss is trying to cover all this up right now as Pure goes for the desperate TP out, but he will be denied that. Toronto Tokyo is going to be caught up in it as well. So double kill with no buyback. No Underlord, no Clockwork. Tundra now in a five versus three with disgusting this. what this Rubik is putting out right now with all the talents online. percent max HP burn right now. The late game is where he shines apparently. Oh, look at that though. Divine Rapier picked up for GPK. Okay, okay. he is not playing around anymore. No. With that Daedalus, remember the last time 33 tried to show up with the, the Ag's Doom and then the Shredder? Yeah, took he might down just half. disappear. <laughs> yeah, he might just die straight up. I mean, that was a double Shredder, so he only has one. He has to use it wisely here, but it is a multi Shredder with the extra hits. Blast off lands, but 33. Doom's already dead. dead. Where's Doom that Shredder? Comes through. They have to back themselves up a little oh, bit here. Oh, the Shredder goes You're through. Gone. That's a double. You're gone, son. Blink and you miss it. GPK puts you back in the well as he got some crits to boot. And he'll take the two for one. <laughs> yeah, they, they we're having a whole time with that damage. Before. Look at that Desolator. Woo. The rockets, not enough. Almost finished off the EY. Well, they found a lasso. Lasso, pulling in the Morphling. They're gonna be able to get the Doom on top of them. They have any four staffs to get the Morphling out of here. They what definitely need to, but the damage is just intense. GPK is making heroes disappear every single time he jumps in, but Bet Boom do base. have the base to worry yeah, about. Yeah, they really have to worry about this. They have Kate to come back, so. Yeah, GPK's not backing down. The aggressive smoke. Yeah, the aggressive smoke in. And buildings, they're letting the creeps actually hit the buildings. The range barracks dies to just that. Yeah, because their base is still getting pressure. There's like stupid Wildekins and shit in their base. <laughs> Why? Why is relentless? He's, he's sending a Warpine in mid. Why, dude? It's so annoying. <laughs> Look at Skeeter with his giant's ring and this invisibility. He's thinking is so far up. He doesn't have Aeon. They don't see him. They see Fred. him now. They spot him now. Immediately, the hook shot. Yeah, or that? Oh, he dies instantly. He is by. He does. And he got a reaction out of Bet. Boom. Toronto, Tokyo maybe didn't want that cookie. With some balls. I'll give him that. Yeah. He has just jumped in every fight. Live or die.
And they are encroaching on your territory, Bed Boom. They are One getting more illusion, mine more mines. Here comes Toronto Tokyo straight into the heart of hell. That cog for it. The cogs blocking it. That's gonna be a BKB wasted at this point. And the Doom, who is jumping back in, turn. now gets on top, goes for the Underlord. They're gonna quickly take him down. That was fast. And Lil Shredder only being used on illusions. There's no real Phantom Lander there. Lanthers. Tundra is playing the kite game perfectly here. Lift, throw him back one at a time, send the illusions in. Tried to go for the cookie, blink away. Meanwhile, Impetus is... That's a pure buyback. He runs forward, nullifiers immediately blocked. Nullifier got onto Skeeter here, but he doppelgangers away to the side. It's gonna be AUI, Little Shredder, two shots, that's all it takes. He will buy back. Oh, he got him with the snaking. Oh, but can he push back by the cogs? Take off the last one, a GPK, they have to get this kill and he's dead. Divine on the deck, who got it? Divine all around. there. Nobody wants it. There's more too much chaos. Mines. Nightfall's trying to get away. A buyback on GPK. He's was... trying to get back in, but he can't get to the Divine Rapier, but I think he might have had a stash. I think Skier... Wait, where'd it go? He got it. He picked it up on oh, 30... Oh, yeah. They're gonna just go back, back in. in. They managed to get the blast off. Buyback immediately on to 9. The no fire and the scythe. Oh, they could go for Skeeter. He oh, lives. Form. Can it catch him? A Glimmer Cape is getting him away. They don't have the detection. Now Skeeter is healing back up. They turn. Then boom, a little bit lost, but they spot their target. That's going to be the doom. Skeeter, he has to try and heal up during this period. He, he keeps on showing himself, fight. though. He keeps on baiting Ben Boom in deeper and deeper. They desperately want this kill. Oh, is that him? Is it not him? It's the Lancer. They're not sure anymore. He's teeping out. He's teeping up in the vision, but Zane couldn't get it off. And meanwhile, the creeps are being dragged out of their Tier base. Tier 4s are dying over here. There is a throne exposed on the Radiant side. Bet Boom have to send Pure back once again. I don't know. Okay, well then don't make fun of my gate plan. <laughs> if you don't, if nobody knows. Listen, you know, I don't know what the right plan something. is, but I know what a bad plan is. <laughs> They're still they, bad. You gotta watch out. No plan. He's gonna be pulled back in. Aghanim Scepter immediately. As soon as they get the lasso, they use the Doom on 33. And if there's anybody who tries to save the person who gets lasso, they're gonna get Doom too. Just like the Underlord now. 33 though yeah, does need some help. That Lotus Orb, Aeon Disc, can only last so long. Gets a Force Staff away. Managed to survive. So they bring down the Underlord for two minutes. And now it's Bet Boom who have to retreat here. Yeah, they need to get the hell out. No Pure for two. That is. No, GPK That's, goes oh, back in. Two. Quickly burst down the Doom. They surprise him, and Nightfall's gonna be able to catch Night uh, the Bat Rider as well. Three dead for Tundra. And now, just like Out that, I mean, the numbers disappear so quickly. It's all about who gets the jump. The advantage goes away in a second. Oh, these are good. You can use them on the building. Oh. Hook shot off the mark. Well, they don't want to let him get out of here with that steal. Yeah, Toronto Tokyo is desperately searching for more, but he's not gonna be able to get it. Just drawing attention with the Aeon Disc, Lotus Orb, bouncing back some spells. But I think maybe he has just committed himself to death. BKB. Oh, BKB! He did, and he he's goes doing in, it. and he goes for the lasso, and he's pulling away the clockwork. Toronto Tokyo gonna be abducted, and he gets doomed up as well. They're gonna throw every spell they have just for a single pickoff because they know Ben oh. Boom are not gonna take advantage oh, of the timer. Your son. Firestorm is great. Minefield landed again. Not. This is some weird siege going on with this. Giant swing over the I mean, the mantra should be the building is lower than it was a minute ago. That is true. Technically, you are winning the game. <laughs> it, it's up to bed, boom. They have to do something to stop this. Here comes the mines. It just crocked one. There's yeah. another. They got the glyph. Oh, they glyphed off of it. That's bad. That's. Oh, really that's no valuable. valuable, especially GPK, who almost dies off the illusion, turns around, tries to fight him, stays alive. But it's yeah, a moment. Nine, nine understands what's going on now. Yep. The chunking has begun. Toronto Tokyo, he's gonna have to buy back. He can be back up for snaking. He could look for another jump, unless he gets jumped. Double fire force down, trying to get snaking away. And Nightfall chasing after him. The waveform can't quite get him. Oh, GPK. Well, GPK's in deep. That's gonna be How the How did he get here? Can they get to him? He has no BKB for two seconds. Can he flick away in a second? Gets the cookie away. Meanwhile, 33 went back to the Mordfling. The Underlord, who pinned it in, is gonna be caught in, in that doom. The Meanwhile, GPK, the he shred. got a couple. It's coming alive here. That boom, they're gonna try and find something. Their base is getting damaged though. The throne, the, the throne, throne is dying. dying. They have to win this fight and have to get back quickly. Throwing in half HP. Meanwhile, the Morphling is getting pummeled by AUI's impetuses. Fortunately, Pure is back into the base. That boom can take a brief sigh of relief, but doing crazy damage. But the problem is he's first such a toxic lineup. I Pushing out, Skeeter's gonna run a GPK, GPK on the low ground. They couldn't get the initiation. They jump in now, but it's a little bit too late. Skeeter's already gotten out. 
Another failed Nobody jump from Bet Boom, and they're gonna get the last one to Toronto Tokyo. The Eon Disc trying to protect him. Once again, they're gonna use the Doom on him because they know it's a dieback. It's got a worth it. They got the No Fire plus the Scythe onto Skeeter. They, and they have to change. They got him. The Blast I got him. Holy crap, GPK he ripped him to shreds. Pure. He just finds Skeeter like that. He's just too good, apparently. They still are going, though, even without Skeeter. Yeah, he has to buy. Flying back. They're gonna be able to kill the Underlord. Jump forward from Nightfall, trying to find more. These heroes do not have buyback on Bet Boom, so Tundra, they can either pull the trigger on their buyback and try and end the game. Somebody else's troll, it's like a an Overlord troll. <laughs> they're, they're like they're getting the skeletons out for the extra rally damage, taking Mist Initiation. It's okay, they can fish for these. If Snake King doesn't get caught thanks to BKB. <laughs> the troll's like, bro, don't send me in there, dog. <laughs> I don't want to go in there. Alright, fine, I'll go, I'll go check it out. Oh, he's getting some damage. He's getting some real damage. Nobody's killing it. No, the creeps are going to take it. Hello? I'm giving this up. Bet boom, anybody home? Mega creeps finally achieved. 95 minutes. It, GPK might kill it. If yeah, but you're, you're, you're... Oh, shit. They're baiting into Roshan. They're just going. They're going to be so That's grouped an enemy up. Pit. Oh, this is going to be dangerous. The enemy pit now. 33's on top of them with the Doom. And they can't kill him quickly. They tried the Shredder, but the Aeontis. Nullifier getting thrown out. They're chasing down some of these heroes. They got through the back line. They got through that damage initially. And now they can chase down Tundra. 33. Quick refresh. Blink away. He's some distance. Playing on the high ground. He needs to choose his times to jump wisely. He did not find much there. Spot Skeeter. There's a real one there. They do the Lincolns. They yeah. got popped. Lincoln, Skull Fire, they know which one's real. He's gonna be damage, 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 damage. Oh, he, got, he got him! Enough Yippee Kaye, motherfucker, GPK takes down the carry. Now kisses on to 33. Can't quite finish him up, but Snaking will die. And 33 did die. Pure comes in with a swipe. GPK kills him. And now Tundra are the ones who have to buy back. Yeah, but look at the base. You still have to go back if you're Bet Boom. <laughs> there's Ench Creeps, there's Catapults. What that is another divine. How, How many do you need? need? How many? How many is enough to end this game? Can he I mean, he needs six. He needs three for now and three for when he buys back. Yeah, he's just saving it for later. He can't even use this one. What did he give up for that defusal? No, he still got the disperser. Oh, he has the disperser. Oh, hookshot missed. Oh, hookshot barely missed. He used the doppelganger just at that moment. They're going to commit. The pit goes through. Nightfall. Straight to the oh, end. Oh, it's already dead. Two minutes on the clock. And Nightfall's going to your points, but he's going to be lasso. They managed to lasso GPK as well. A Hooked double, double. Together. Oh, no. It's all falling apart Nightfall for Bedford. Buys. A second life here for GPK. Can keep... he do anything out of this? He's what coming back. going to be Doom. Half health. GPK's Peter, gone. Riding him down. He is dead so easily. This is this is a disaster now for Bedford. second Doom. Nightfall does manage to get off his Satanic, trying to stay alive. The die back. Satanic. Oh, staking. He dies for it. That's going to be GPK a back to picks up the rapier. Their heroes the are shred. running in. The, the shred. shred. Trying to get it off. He's going to be the door. Time for the throw. Oh.